If you want to see how I got this fast moving solution glitter cup, then you're going to have to go ahead and stay tuned. Okay? Okay. <music> What's up, y'all? It's your girl, Winnie, and I'm back <laughs> with another video. If you're new to my channel, please go ahead and consider subscribing to your girl's channel. New videos posted every Tuesday and Thursday, sometimes on Wednesday, depending on what's going on. A1 since day one, or however long you've been here, I shall appreciate you. Now, I ain't nothing talking about already, man. It's all love. So today, I am going to be showing you guys, um, again, some of y'all are some uh, OG triple triple, and some of y'all are new, so some of y'all may not have seen you know what I'm saying? That I've done this before on my channel. <laughs> okay. Okay. What am I watching? I don't even know what I'm watching. I think that's Chicago Med. I don't know. But today I'm using contact solution. And so I'm using uh, rose gold for this one. Um, the rose gold chunky is from Michaels and it's called rose gold. And then the fine is from Michaels. Then I had some blush that I got off of Amazon and uh, I think another color, uh, some other type of rose gold that I had. And so I just made a, a custom mix because custom mixes is what I do. Custom mix is what I do. Okay. So I like to put some solution into the cup first. Um, that way the glitter ain't sticking all down to the bottom. However, comma pause, that don't always work because um, around here, glitter and solution does what it wants to do okay but you see how pretty that's already falling you know what i'm saying so in my opinion contact solution is a faster solution um because it's just strictly there's no glycerin there's no glue ain't no oil there's nothing in there it's just straight contact solution um it's not my favorite to do but uh for the sake of content for the sake of people that want to get out there and may want to start a tumblr business this for y'all, you know what I'm saying? This, that's for y'all. I'm, I'm doing this for you. So I always like to have something down on the table because, um, look, baby, um, with my table, I did my table myself. Yes, my table's rose gold <laughs> and it matches this cup right here. So if you ain't caught the trend, your girl like rose gold, okay? I just really started liking rose gold and um, some rose golds look more pink than actual rose gold, so we don't we don't like those. But um, this one, I really like this color and how this cup turned out. So you know, I just decided. I said to myself, myself said, huh? I said we gonna go ahead and continue to make mixes. So from here on out, any glitter that you see, I'm more than likely mixed with some other glitter to achieve the desired effect that I wanted to achieve with it. Okay, okay. So. Um, yeah, what I was doing right there was um, I'm trying to get the glitter off of the round of the side of the cup um, up here at the top, but it really wasn't working out for you, girl. You know what I'm saying? So I added more solution and um, it still it still didn't do that. So that's the issue with contact solution is that you are going to have like the separation and you're going to, you know, have that separation throughout the lifetime of the cup. And um, so I do allow my cups, all cups uh are degassed for at least 24 hours or more and when i say degassing that means allowing the air bubbles to escape and um what i do is ever so often i'll go over to the little section where the cups are and i'll refill it with whatever solution um that i'm using at the time and you know that's just that with that and i told y'all to hold on because i was doing something oh i'm writing um writing the name of the solution on the cup so the cups did stay um with the tape on there until i was ready to do with them what i was gonna do so this is what i'm doing right here is just adding a little bit more solution to the cup that way it's um as full as it can be um, but you're also going to have some issues with uh, space because the glitter is heavier than the liquid. So that's going to cause the liquid to rise. And it's going to seem like you don't have a full cup. But if you're like me and you tilt the cup every which way, sideways, however many different ways you can um, 
tilt the cup to ensure that you get the maximum amount of solution in there i mean it's just going to be that's just it it just is going to be what it's going to be you know what i'm saying and so i don't have a funny story time today this video is only seven minutes and 53 seconds long so i'm going to go ahead and exit if you have any questions comments or concerns you can leave them down below this has been journey with wendy i'm e she her and wendy new videos posted every tuesday and thursday sometimes on wednesdays depending on what's going on and if you have any questions comments or concerns oh this right here i was using the um what your name is gorilla glue adhesive dots no ma'am no ma'am no sir i i won't be using these no more um yeah these just it just didn't do it for me it is not because of my nails i i've i've worn longer lengths it this just wasn't it for the kid okay and so with that you know what that means that your girl is what your girl is ayo